It's 6.30 a.m. We're in Glendale, Arizona. Nice, cool morning. My back feels better this morning. So let's go for a ride. Well, I'm out early on a Sunday morning, but it looks like my neighbor's been out earlier than me. Let's see if he looks up and sees me. He's not as young as he used to be, but nobody I know is. <laughs> Good morning. It's October 13th, and here in the Phoenix, Arizona area, it's an absolutely delicious 70 degrees Fahrenheit. I just love riding through these little neighborhoods. This is my noodling speed, which is a little bit faster than walking, sort of like a, a jog, and not as fast as most bicycles go. Of course, the trike can go faster, and since it's Sunday morning, without a lot of traffic, I decided to try the bike lane. I got the trike up to a top speed of 14 miles per hour, which was about as fast as I felt comfortable going, although serious cyclists could go faster than me, and they could use this bike lane for commuting. It's going to take a while for cities to get used to how people use transportation other than cars, because this is a fairly narrow bike lane. And if someone wanted to pass me, even if I was in a bicycle, they'd kind of have to go out into the car lane, so it should be wider. It'll get there. In my experience, most people don't ride a bicycle unless they're kids, so getting people to design spaces for pedaling can be a challenge. If anybody's out there who wants to hear from me, my advice is completely free. Well, I finally got to use the big gear today, but I don't think I'm going to use it much. I prefer noodling around. Thanks for riding with me. See you next time. <laughs>